As we take off the top plate, you will see that I have my stack screws coming in from above because I'm using the TBS Lucid ESC that uses the Gorilla mounting. I have the stack screws going all the way through the frame like a standard drone. These stack screws come in from the top and go into a metal mounting bracket on top of the ESC, but it works awesome and the Lucid has been one of our favorite AM32 ESCs here at the shop. As you see, we have the UFL pointed up and to the front and this gives us the perfect length for the antenna mount to be mounted here in the back with a 45 millimeter true RC antenna, which I'll have a link to down below. As I take off the Race V3, see that we have the Halo flight controller mounted upside down with a USB port facing down. The reason being is the HD Zero very cleverly put all of the tallest components facing down with the USB port, leaving the other side as flat as possible, meaning that you can very comfortably squeeze your HD Zero Race V3 down pretty hard without worrying you're gonna short anything. And this allows you to get a shorter stack. On the other side, you will see the two UFLs here. And I have the long antenna running out to the arm, as I said, and the short antenna running just to my top plate, as you see here.